welcome back to my channel. My name is Lynn here, and today I'm going to talk about some stuff. Actually, um, first it's going to be discussing a topic that I talked about the last time, which I did in the video, because um, yeah, misunderstoodness, you know, yeah, it's all good. It's all good. <laughs> Don't copyright me. Um, but yeah. So I would first like to say, um. I wasn't pointing kind of at anyone for that last video. I was just saying in general, but I did point a little bit of people. But I did not address your name at anyone. And I would not hate you at all. I'm just, I was just kind of mad, you know? Um, I get mad. Um, I'm stressed out. There's a lot happening. I'm not kidding. Um, but anyways, the next thing I'm going to talk about is a story time. Because I love to have stories. Um, no, it's actually my first story time, I think. I don't know, I've, I've posted another one, but anyways, let's get started. So, I'll start on Friday last week. So, Friday last week was a, my, my second last track meet for my track team. Yes, I do track, I'm not that good. But, you know, I do javelin the 800, the 800 is half a mile, and it's two laps around the track thing, and javelin, jab is just javelin, it's a throwing event, and I'm not... I'm not, I'm like in the middle for that, I'm really bad, but it was raining that day, and we still had it, it was like pouring outside, but you know, second last track meet, you can't cancel that, same when someone makes a loud noise, stop, oh my god, okay, <laughs> but anyways, so, you know, I was all good, I really didn't want to run the 800, because it was wet out, and, but, you know, I had to, because, um, the track coach is actually, like, bipolar, just thinking about that, she probably is, um, but she's, like, really mean to me, I'm not liked by her, she doesn't like me, it's probably because I'm, like, five, uh, no, I'm <laughs> not five, I need to stop making that joke before I, someone actually believes me, but otherwise, so, I was running, so I start, so I was on the third or the second heat, I don't remember, one of the last two, because I am legit so slow, I can sprint and all that, and I still would be slow, I just don't have very good winds, and my legs, they are long, extremely long, but I run in a kind of like tiny little steps, which I have to like get better at, because I had a leg injury, kind of at the beginning of the track, and it hurt to extend my leg, because it's having growing pains, so I was like, okay, yeah, this sucks, so I was started, so, um, you know, how like the fire gun, you know, <laughs> it didn't go out the first time, so I was freaked out, this was my second time running the 800, and, you know, yeah, and I wasn't feeling that good the week, that week, so I was like, that's great, that's really great, so I was running it, you know, you know, feeling all good, and then I just, like, I, um, you know, I couldn't breathe, well, I couldn't breathe, kind of, you know, um, I was just kind of, like, couldn't really breathe that much, but I could still breathe, you know, it was all good, but, you know, I didn't feel so well, so I stopped running after the first lap, and I know it sounds like, oh, you're really, like, out of shape, but no, this, I could run 800, but, you know, whatever, just, like, this two weeks, I haven't been able to run it, so then the next meet, no, actually, that, that was the week before, but then, no, you know, that was that meet, yeah, so then this meet on Monday, um, that I just did, you know, I was running, you know, doing all my stuff, I felt really good, I felt so good about it, and let me just say, I did really bad on job both times, um, please stop, I was like in the 30 to 40 range. I know, I suck. I'm tiny, this is my first year doing track, okay? I'm not gonna say which age group it is, because then you guys will think I'm tiny again, because I'm not, okay? Fight me, because <laughs> everyone thinks I'm 10. So I was running it, and the division was up to, um, I don't know. I also don't know right now, but. I don't remember what the divisions were up to, but, you know, yeah. So, I was running, I felt really good. At first lap, I felt good. But then it just hit me. I couldn't breathe. Like, I was suffocating kind of thing, you know. Like, it just 
blocked up at my throat and I could not breathe. Like, not the <laughs> breathing, you know, I could, like, oh, I could, I really wanted to breathe like that, but I could not, like, you would die breathing, you know? I couldn't. So I was like, I'm still thinking this was an asthma attack, but, you know, I was like, oh, it's probably just, uh, I don't have enough wind for it. But like I started crying and like I just jumped off the track and like I had to have people like help me breathe and it took a while. So I saw all my friends just running past me and I was like, oh, that's nice. And like I had one of my friends who was in the first heat. She helped me like kind of breathe and all that. Like, um, you know, she was like comforting me. But then my sister and my best friend, the whole world, came out onto the field and started helping me. Like they were hugging me and all that. You know, it was all good. Um, but yeah, they were trying with jokes, which made me feel really bad. And I just really wanted to leave. So because I did jab like an hour before, so I could leave after that race. But so I like left and all that and I was having breathing problems that whole day. I had a sore throat this whole week and I still have it, so that was great. So then the next day, yeah, the next day I had to do the school mile. Yeah, <laughs> great. So I can't actually go to the doctor to see if I have asthma because my family, there is someone in my family who has asthma, so I could have it. And also you can still get asthma, um, yeah, so during the mile, I could not breathe <laughs> once again. So I had to stop like two times and just sit there. Not sit, because you can't breathe like that kind of. It's really bad for you. So I just, you know, stand there, started walking, like walking fast. Because like, I know I'm probably gonna get a really bad time and I did. Um, but I'm actually, I get like eight minutes of my miles. Um, which is a 1500, which I don't do because I refuse. Um, so it just like took two minutes off. I took two, I added two minutes from doing that two times and you know, but I had to, I couldn't breathe in. I can't go check if I have asthma because we have state testing the whole week. And if you miss one day of state testing, it's very bad, you know, so I just, you know, I can't go still. Um, I probably have to go on Friday if we don't have it. But on Friday I'm going to the carnival cause I love life. So that was, um, yeah, so this kid, so when I finished it, I was crying because I, I really wanted to just like be like, I can't, like, I really want to stop, you know, just go to the teacher, but she just think I'm underweight, and like, no, I'm not, that's not the word, I'm out of shape, um, and yeah, so, you know, she's gonna probably give me a zero because it was a homework grade if you got better you would get absolutely a hundred. So, yeah, and there goes my grade. I have to have my mom email her that I couldn't, like, read and all that, because that's probably what's gonna happen. And so, yeah, I'm excited to go to class, yay. But, you know, some kid um, who's the fastest runner, he has asthma, I'm like, thanks. Um, but, like, he does sprinting and all that. I think he's managed it good, but he's all, uh, probably, like, uh, under, yeah. Uh, I don't know, I don't think he really has it, but he was born with asthma, and he was saying, were you having an asthma attack? Because it really looked like it. And so I'm like, believing that I have an asthma attack, and like a lot of kids were saying that I was having one. I was like, okay, so, yeah, and my mom said I had one too, so when I told her about it, and because I'm like really concerned for me <laughs> right now, but you know, my friends started to be like, oh, poo poo, because <laughs> I'm not saying bad words. And say that I didn't, you can't just get asthma out of nowhere. But I was actually pretty wheezy. Like, wheezy is a thing from asthma, you know. If you guys have asthma, you'd kind of know what I mean. I was pretty wheezy when I was a child. I would have to leave summer camp from that. Or, like, I would have to stay at home sometimes because I was felt wheezy. So, um, I could have been born with asthma, but I never had symptoms of it, like, until, like, now. Because I was busy, but that was just a normal thing because it was the summertime and there was pollen. So my mom just said, oh, don't worry, it's just pollen, don't worry, it's just allergies. So I'm like, Ugh. So yeah, and so my friend was just yelling at me that I can't just get out of all that. I was like, yes, I can't. I'm like, yeah, you don't know my past history, but if I do have it, okay, sorry, I will fight someone. And so, like, <laughs> wanna fight me? 
So now this whole week I've been like fighting me and I'm like really scared to run because yeah, that, that's great. But anyways, it's so over. But for jab, I quote, um, I PR'd, if you guys know what that means, previous record. Um, no, I passed record. Yeah. I'm great and I got candy because my, my coach gives candy to anyone who qualifies for PRs. Kiss. Um, but yes, yeah, so the track's over. So yeah, don't worry. There might be some more uploads. But you know, I'm really busy. I'm on a tight schedule. Mm, yeah, because I'm testing. <laughs> and I know I'm going candy, which is great. But yeah, so. I just thought I would do a little story time on that. Since it was kind of like a big, big thing that just happened. So yeah. 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 We'll see how my shop's doing. If you guys don't know I have a shop here, if you guys don't stay in with my stuff. Yeah. It's right there. It's really sad. I don't think I'll get anything. But let's actually go down to here. If you guys um bought yourself like a spot on Pikachu's land. Um, it's like eight billion, so Sorry, I know it's a lot, but I bought it when I literally had so much money. And so I bought myself a little thing on here so I could get some stuff. But you know, yeah, yeah. So um, I can go to the shop, it's really expensive. Yeah, that's nice, really, it's really nice. Um, so they go here sometimes, other times just sell it at the normal thing, but yeah. I hope you. Same. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of like a story time legacy realms thing. I'm sorry for my private video. Um, it's on private now. And um, yeah, I don't hate any of you. I love you guys so much. Bye.